I see the evidence of your goodness, Jesus, all over my life today. I want to come on here real quick. It's cold. I'm warming up the car and I'm heading out. Uh, uh, going up the road a little bit, seeing who I can help that may be in need. I've got my mask. Hold on. Hold on a minute. Hang on. And uh, there's so many people hurting this time of year. And it's a time where we need to pull together. I got my mask. Social distancing. <laughs> time to pull together and uh, take care of the least of these, the children of God who have nothing this time of year. So I'm heading out, letting the car warm up a little bit. Probably gonna stop at Tim Hortons, eh? And get a cup of coffee, but I wanna come out here. and Just, uh, I don't know how to get the point across, the urgency, the lateness of the hour, the lateness of the hour. We see Bible prophecy. We see it, we've seen it for so long. So many prophets on YouTube, everywhere you go. All over the YouTube channels are the prophecy here, a prophecy there, a prophecy everywhere. But we are in the lateness of the hour. This is not a prophecy. This is telling you that he's coming. Jesus is coming. He's even at the door. You need to be rapture ready. We can see with the plagues, the famines, the starvation, the pestilence, the disease, this, this outbreak of COVID-19. Now, Donald Trump is saying that as soon as next week, people will be lining up to get the vaccine. Be ready. He's coming. Emmanuel. He's on his way. And we just need to be ready. We need to be prepared hands-free I'm driving and uh, I just want to come on here and try to bring you some love today and encouragement so that you know that uh, no matter what you're going through right now no matter what you're facing look what I've been through and no I don't feel a hundred percent I'm not a hundred percent I'm blessed to be here I'm blessed to be alive to see the coming of our Lord and Savior Jesus in the clouds that we're going to meet him in the clouds and we can see the darkness that has fallen over the land blanketed we talk about winter the snow uh, a blanket of snow I'm talking about a blanket of darkness of evil that has covered the entire world Satan's playground we're living in Satan's playground right here right now he's after our family he's after our children our children are mistreating us. Um, they're not doing what they're supposed to be doing. Many are not working. Many are still staying at home. Many are acting out, shouting out, unbelievers, non-believers, getting into the occult, not even knowingly, uh, getting into all types of things that the world, of the world, not of the Lord, but of the world. And it's a battle. We're battling for our life. We're battling for our children's life. We're battling for our husband's life, our wives' lives. We're battling for family, for friends, co-workers, loved ones that are not born again, that are not saved. Today, people are going out to the shopping centers and shopping malls and uh, looking for what kind of deal can they get and they call this black friday i remember another friday i remember another friday where jesus gave you the deal of a lifetime and it was eternal everlasting eternal life i'm in a roundabout here it's kind of tricky so give me a second there we go this guy's gonna be nice and let me go you're supposed to flow with the traffic but nobody would let me through but uh here we go but we have to accept that precious gift. He's not going to force it on us. So I want you to pray. That's the key. That's what saved me. All of your prayers. Pray. Pray for your family, for your loved ones, for your spouse, for your children. In this darkest of times, the darkest of, hour, of this hour, Jesus could come at any moment, any second, any time. 
I love you guys and uh, keep me in your thoughts and prayers I head out today with our ministry knowledge to the homeless and uh, pray for those less fortunate pray for those that you do not know pray show show love show the love of Jesus in you even if it's just a smile be good to one another husbands love your wives wives be good to your husbands raise up your children in the Lord Jesus is the word the way the truth and the life be rapture ready because he's coming and he's coming quickly God bless